Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Finders Keepers. Here we are, once again, on our giant Purdom. Looking at our giant carrier. And tonight, we're actually going to be joined by Nab right at the beginning, and I am the dum-dum that forgot to enter events. I'm in voice now, that's all fine. There we go. Hello, Coldstone, Zimmelstern, Jay Catroni, Immoral Bites, Krasriel, and of course, Space Pirate Captain Rush, who I believe is actually has actually joined us in the game. Yeah. Oh, we've got a we've got quite the crew today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven folks. Other than myself, including the Nabarine. So six folks that aren't ball and chain gaming itself. Alright, so today. Nabbers. I think I want to get the, uh, get a lot of the carrier construction done. I don't know how we are doing on our stuff here. Yeah, I'm looking. Let's see. Ah, uh, we're okay on iron. Nickel's looking okay. Uh, we will. Silicon is a little actually low. Still got a bunch of cobalt. We don't use that much cobalt. We might need cobalt soon. Yeah, we don't use a ton of cobalt, and even this next thing, most of the grids that we need have already been made. But we'll see. Hey, Blue Set. Hey, Jewel Calf. Welcome, welcome. There we go. So I was told at one point that the music was too loud. Let me know if it's at a good level right now. I've also moved my mic, so I'm hoping I sound better. But we'll see. I'm going to start cutting out things that don't belong and pasting things that do. Because I did do a lot of uh, modifications on that one build stream that designed this. Yeah, there's just some things that aren't there. I actually did a little bit of weldy stuff while I was working on it earlier. I got the thumbnail. I did a little bit of welding and placing. Grinding, too. I don't remember making... So it's interesting that the, uh, the projector seems to be making the concrete red, despite the fact that I made it black in the actual projection. Well, yeah, but the actual, the, the blueprint I have, it was black and white and gray. So interesting that it has chosen to do this. Oh, I can probably turn the nab cam on now, yeah? Oh, look at that. Look at, look at, the, look at the nab cam. I could watch the nab cam all day. We will need so many steel plates. What? Can you hear me now? How about now? How about now? How about now? What? 
Discord, why do you be terrible? How about now? Testing. Testing. Test. OBS isn't the main window. I'm. It's, if I'm in Space Engineers, it's not letting it work. Yeah, I know, but can you hear me now? be good. Audio. I'm going to try something real quick. Hang on, folks. I have to disable Discord. How about now? That's better. I'm running it as administrator now. And that seems to work. first base. <laughs> oh! I keep on trying to land on projections and it doesn't work well. I fell! It's interesting. All of the, all of the black has been replaced by this maroon. That's so interesting. We have so much cutting and grinding and welding to do. This is going to be a nice, quiet build stream. It's too late. I said it. I said it. Now it's going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to be nice and quiet. Whole time. And I'm not an awful human. You can't, you can't say that. Only I can say that. Correct. I don't have bad self-esteem because my, uh, both my education experience recently and my experience at work has made me feel like smarter than the average human because my goodness not going to detail about work but school whew. like the you ever get the feeling you're smarter than the person who wrote the course yeah that's happening pretty hard as you heard me earlier today going why <laughs>
Uh huh. Yep, I actually reported it to the the professor. Like, uh, by the way. Well, she did. I doubt she wrote the course. She's probably just teaching it. It's an online college, so. I fix it. Now you can hear Nab. Now you can hear Nab. Thanks for letting me know, guys. Wow. This whole time? The whole time. I forgot to push the other button, or it didn't take when I pushed it. So, hi, Nab. How are you doing for the first well, time in the stream? Yeah, I've been here the whole time. Hi. Do you want to start that whole sentence again about how you're talking about the, uh, the schooly stuff? Sure. Um... Yeah. <laughs> There it is. There yeah, it there is. it is in chat. I'm wondering how blatant. Well, most YouTube YouTube's is. pretty terrible at uh, th at things, and YouTube uh, prioritizes quality over latency all the time. So what's going on Energy. is everyone's no. like several. Yeah, it could be up to a minute behind. Well, we're glad that the boys came in and mentioned yep. that. Anyway, so I just don't want people getting the wrong of the wrong idea about DE. Just being I'm, like, so oh, I'm so I'm smart. I'm the smartest person ever. Yeah, I'm, I'm really not. No, <laughs> but um, this lady, it's not. You know, we doubt she's the one who wrote the test, but the test itself, um, or the course itself, was literally asking what the definition of irony was and it was wrong the answer that they were looking for was incorrect it was not the definition at all yeah it was like the modern definition it was like some people think the irony means something unfortunate it's actually something funny or uh unusual it's like no it's something it's something that is contrary to what is normal and that is possibly self-caused or like like uh, an example would be it would be ironic if i was like man i just i just love rocks rocks are the best and then a meteor hit and killed me that'd be pretty ironic <laughs> that'd be pretty ironic yes so but but it's like people misuse irony all the time and apparently some of the people who wrote the course energy critical oh no my energy is critical no oh wait it's nice and warm here Possibly two more. By the way, if you're wondering, if you get on a ladder and then get off the ladder, your jetpack turns back on and you smash into the wall at high speed. Oh. Ow. What is happening? I don't know. What is happening? I don't know. I'm just weldy welding. There's a light panel here and then it... It's doing the thing where it's telling me this is a light panel, but I know it's not. Uh, let me see. I'll be right there. Okay. That block in the middle. That's not a light panel, is it? Glass door. You just gotta get closer. N no. It was like in the block. It didn't matter. Light, light, light panel's here. I know that. Weldy, 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 weld. Whoa, I just went scattering across the deck. Wah. But yeah, that misuse of the word was just like, that's just the beginning. But I was mentioning that as a teacher, I never used multiple choice because it is the it is like the worst way to assess somebody's knowledge. I can uh, I can tell you what they want by looking at the question. Yeah. Like I I can figure out what the answer is just because not all the questions are the same. 
or not all the answers are the same. And it's like, oh, hey, I bet you that's the one they want. One of these things is not like the others. One of these things does belong. Oh, this is one of the larger grids I've ever made in Space Engineers by that hand. saying something? In, uh, well, I mean, by, by welding, you know? I guess. Especially by hand. It's a good thing that you have, like, the champion of welding blocks with you. Yes, yes, she's right. She's right next to me. Will I make a new flyer? I will make a new flyer, but I want to get this done first, and I need to design the flyer. I could I could print off another one of the scout planes, a couple of them, and I might do that. Well, only a 25% chance of getting it right by guessing, which is yes, not... Yes, but it's still a chance of getting it right just by guessing, which is not cool. I don't mind multiple choice in terms of like uh, learning, like learning the material, like if, as a as a as like a knowledge check tool, but as a, sure because as an then you test, can yeah. yeah as an actual test it's it's garbage. But if you are just trying to see where somebody is and you can be like, oh nope, you got the answer wrong and here's why, then that's fine. But you have to get the answer. <sighs> the definition of the answer has to be correct in order yeah. for that to work. Oh, one of the questions was in the picture, true or false, in the picture, her expression was hard to read. There was no picture. It was talking about a picture that was in the actual material. Because It's a communications class and they were talking about verbal cues and, and non-verbal cues and all that other stuff. But, like, I have concerns. Uh, I could make some Toblerones, but I need to figure out where my blueprint is. I 100% forgot that you named your little ship, your flying plane, a Toblerone, <laughs> and I was like, why, what? Why would we make Toblerones? I, re I still remember having to get rid of them as if they even sent you. Hmm. That was amazing. Yes. I still have it on the wall behind me. Yeah. Uh, hang on. Let's see, we'll turn on. I'm turning on my camera so I don't stand up. Okay. Miss inappropriate for stream. Okay. Uh, video capture device. So if we look up there, you can just see it right there. Hey, uh, yeah, see it above my finger there? Right there? That's a Toblerone wrapper. That's what that is. That's a Toblerone wrapper, and it is enormous. And Scarlet is a crazy person. I'll turn the camera off now. Do I sound any different to you, Nab, in the microphone? Uh, you are muted again. For me. How about now? You're not, now you're not. Is this better? Uh, you're gone again. What? I don't know. The I actual butts is happening. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. How about now? Nope. It's on voice activity now. Is okay. It, is it working? Yep. I don't understand what's happening. I don't get it. I really don't. Yuju's compression is horrible. Looked like a light smudge on the black background. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Well, I mean, if you if you go to the the higher to 1440, because I'm streaming in 1440, it should force the better codec and be able to see it better. Because there's 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 compression happening on both ends, which is not great. You don't want to compress both ends. That's how you burst something. Light panel. Let's get that there and just grab a bunch of them. Either way, it's, I mean, like, it's huge. Yeah. 
uh, three feet long, I believe. Something like that. It, and it, like, weighed, it weighed like 15 or 16 pounds. It was just, just this was, massive chunk of chocolate. It was ridiculous. And Scarlet was so happy with himself. <laughs> There's a picture of it. We took a picture of it. I mean, and the whole thing happened because he overheard that I like Toblerones. Like, it's not even my favorite candy or anything. He's just like, oh, do you like Toblerones? I'm like, yeah. And then this thing shows up in the mail. Yeah, Vice Core does crush the blacks too too easily. He's all sorts of awful things happening to the compression of the video. Energy now. Yeah. I need to hug you. I'll get directed energy. Hey yo. Hey yo. And all this wildy. And we'll start you and you and you and you. We grab all the stuff. Vicecore wants to know what's your favorite candy. Oh, that's is. a tough one. I know which ones you like, but a that's, favorite that's a tough one. Like, so, so you, like candy, oh, candy. <laughs> I love candy, but I've liked it less and less as it makes my teeth hurt and my stomach feel awful and make me feel sluggish. Yeah, because um, he's gotten he's been trying to eat better and when you eat better your body goes oh that's right these things are nice and these things aren't yeah it's lame <laughs> sometimes uh i just chew something up and then spit it out are you serious <laughs> yeah because I that's like, like one step from being bulimic be careful with that <laughs> no it's just to taste it and it's not it's never it's like it's just, like, just to taste it, just to see how it feels. This just sounds familiar somehow. <laughs> no, it's uh, it's generally like, for example, those little um, those little chocolate balls, right? Just to chew it up and taste it, because I've been working so hard not to get off the plan. So you're telling me you chew them up and spit them in the garbage? Sometimes. Not when I much. could have eaten them for real. Correct. <laughs> how dare? <laughs> the garbage can is better out. How dare. Most of the time I just eat it. But if I had had a particularly bad day where I knew that if I started eating something for real, uh -oh. it would be a problem, then yeah. Am I charped? Yes. Are you charped? I am charped. I have charped myself. Okay, well, go ahead and just, you know... Oh, wait, no, down. no, I'm free. I'm free. Oh, my goodness. Well, I had to... There's something else that needed to be ground down here. It's... There's something under a big plate. Careful. Careful. Uh, yeah, it's... Oh, my goodness. So we're down to... We're now down to one support holding the whole thing up. That's why I wanted... So if one more bad gr grind and the whole thing falls. Hang on. Let me build another support in a done part of the shape. So this here, I can now weld up. It was just something in the way. Um, it's hard to tell. There is something still under here. I won't bug it, but I can't weld up that gun unless whatever the heck is under here. Have you tried looking down. and seeing what's under there? Uh, yes. Thank you. There's another block in the way. So weld the other block. What other block? You said there's a block in the way. <laughs> because it's it's already welded up, this block. An armor block. It says it. Yes, but you were like, oh, don't do it because... Th we're we're. Well, the reason I was like, don't do that, hold on, was because I didn't want the other one accidentally done. Ta-da! So I think there's stuff under here. Yeah, there's- Ah, oh, simply! Did that one was there's fine. Stuff under, well, no, there's stuff underneath it that has to be done. Oh, this. Yeah, so all that needs to be done first. Garbage. Usually doesn't it catch that? No. No, oh, because it did for me over stupid. here. It's very... Well, over here it stopped. It didn't do the plate 
until after the thing in the back was finished. Inventory so. full. Inventory full. Motor and construction. Fuel low. Oh no, fuel low. No, no, no. No! Ow, 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 dead. Fuel critical. <laughs> My corpse skids across the ground out from under the rover. That is, that's just perfect. It's okay, you don't have to be worried about it. And no, it was not malt balls. So, uh, the Girl Scouts came out with these, uh, Girl Scout bites. And they're just little balls of whatever the cookie is. So, they were their, uh, Thin Mint, uh, little cookie bites. Don't have to worry. I promise I'm being healthy. <laughs> mm -hmm. She looks really healthy. She went to the gym and dudes were checking her out. It's true, actually. I thought you said you didn't know if they were or not. And, <gasps> well, I Gasp! They would look and then they'd look away. It's not like they were ogling well, me. Yeah, because they don't want to get, like, killed. I would murder them, probably. Well, not you, anybody. <laughs> <laughs> like be, being being a guy and accidentally looking because that's such a, that's a thing by the way that is a thing and suddenly uh you're like an offender and you're being hauled away to jail or something it's it's insane <laughs> right now like absolutely don't ogle ladies in the gym but ladies please please have some grace we're trying. Most of us are trying. What is everyone's plans for Easter? Uh, go over to the grandparents. And yeah, I'm singing in church and so are the kids. I know that song. I love that song. I know you I think it's weird, but I like it. It's grown on me. I didn't like, cause when I heard it, I only heard one version of it and I was like I don't like this song okay. so it was just Fair whoever enough. was singing it yeah still not my favorite but it's an okay song I've I have put some feeling into it <laughs> feeling mm. ah! fell down Um, I do not know if I'm making anything. I think we're going to make cupcakes tomorrow, though. Cupcakes? Cupcakes. Our daughter is so excited for cupcakes that she went to bed by herself. Which is a big deal. She loves cupcakes. But then, yeah, we every every Sunday we go over to D.E.'s parents' house. So that's the plan. And the kids will be able to hunt for eggies. Eggies! Eggies. Hey, the thing where steel plates aren't being built, that's a thing again. Again? <laughs> well, we just are out of the like 10,000 or so I made last time. I turns was out, making some too. Turns out that a ship this size takes lots of steel plate. I'm gonna see some real quick. Do we have a lot over here? Going over to the the ground station one. I don't remember making too much. I put an assembler over there. I thought. Wait, no. Well, there's an assembler over here. Oh, there's a bunch of iron in here. I'm gonna have yeah, to build there's a nothing lot of with steel iron. plates. I'm just building steel plates like a mad person. There's a bunch in here too. Takes so many steel plates. Yep. 
You know what to bring, I said. Steel plates. Cupcakes. No. Uh, vice score. Yeah. Like, this would almost certainly go faster if I built, like, a welding chip or something. But there's something I enjoy about just yep. welding it up by hand. Yep, yep, yep. I know that, uh, Zori was talking about trying to get back together before she leaves the state by score, so we should probably figure that out. Sounds like a Zori problem. <laughs> How about cupcakes? Uh, cupcakes. Cupcakes and steel plates, yes. Yes, loves those. And as I fill up more of these uh, solar panels, we'll get more energy. Oh, the sun's getting low again. Oh, I forgot to reset the sun. The sun's getting real low. Oh, well, too late now. Okay, so the gyros use uh, grids. Yes, yes, I do. So I'm a, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and mark some of those. Oh, good day. Prime rib. I like prime rib. Actually, I prefer uh, if 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 there's a a type of steak I like the most, it is tri tip. I enjoy a good tri tip steak. It's meaty. Fairly lean and always delicious, especially when I make them. Do I make good steak, my dear? Yeah, you do. I make good steak. It's hard sometimes because you're colorblind, um, but yeah, sometimes it's a little rarer than I mean it to be. But it's yes. still it's sometimes it, it just means there's more flavor. Yeah, sometimes it's like, oh look, it's perfectly done, and it is for most of it. <laughs> Hmm. What are you working on? What are you welding? Well, I'm trying to figure out why this is yellow. Is it just because we don't have power? No, wait. It's not connected to anything out here. That's why. The kinetic point defense is just not done. So yep. it's like, oh, it's not <laughs> Got a few batteries that need to be built still. Slowly, uh, slowly coming up off that single wind turbine we've got up on the deck. I just realized I forgot to put a place where it could easily refuel. I think this thing. Yes, I can. Some thermometers are in freedom units. What are you talking about? <laughs> um, 
Um, we have dancing blocks over here. Dancing blocks? Yeah, come over here. Come on. What do you mean dancing blocks? So there's obviously something that's welded up here, but there's a different thing that's supposed to be welded underneath. Do you see them? Yeah. This is just steel plates in this engine, so I'm just going to ride off. Armor block. Okay. And then there's probably another armor block here. Okay. There we go. Oh, the armor blocks are supposed to be there. Okay. We're good um, there. I'm in a cargo container right now. That doesn't seem to have access to any... Oh. There's, there's things. There should be a car container and then a car container and a car container. There's three yeah, they are not welded. Yeah, so they just need to be welded. Let me out. There. Well. Uh, oh, we're out of silicon. Oh, no, we're not. Never mind. Thought one we of the turret uh, things is done. It's all done. I've got the one of the lower car containers done. Oh, shoot. Conveyor junction needs to be built. Do to do. Oh dear. Please be okay, please be okay, please be okay. Oh, that doesn't look okay. That doesn't oh, no. look okay. Oh, that doesn't look okay. Oh my goodness. Oh no. It's missed. Oh. oh. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. That was scary. Hey, I found some nickel.
Mm. No lucky platinum this time. And we're out of iron. Uh oh. Mm hmm. I agree. Okay. Which means we're gonna fire this up, I think, again. See what our outfit's like. That's got a bunch of magnesium in it, so. Hello, Gorbin. That's all ice. That's all ice. Uh, no. There's iron right over there. That's right. Are you done charging? Like control panel. ship and I'm going to drop off a load of stuff and I'm going to fly over and grab iron because it's just right over there over yeah there. it's just like a little less than five kilometers away the ship can fly over there no problem there's also some silicon it looks like that was probably deposited by a meteor yeah I mean we get that we get a lot of that just from the dirt mm -hmm. once we get through the ice layer on the uh doodad that'll be a lot let's see hmm. cargo I shall return. Whee! Wow, I'm. This thing's really fast. Oh, oh, unstable at that speed. 
Aerodynamics taking over. Hey, Corbin Dallas. How's your multipass doing? Hey, there's some ice from the the drops. Oh, a little bit of silver. I have to grab that too. I didn't see that. That's over here by the kind of by the old base. I put lights on this thing. Why? Right. Yeah, just not being turned on. There we go. The navy hole you made over here for the iron is perfect for this particular miner. Mm-hmm. Well Which done. is why I made it. Well, we made it for the other one. It was a, it was difficult for the other one, but this one is like, yes, please give me more. truth of that stone pumping out some iron oh my gosh I can now fly but barely <laughs> I'm bringing home iron oh good my goodness display that's what that needed back here yay display oof she says i'm bringing home many much iron hooray uh about 100k big heavy oof mm. <clears throat> It's kind of cinematic.
no, 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 Oof. What happened? It's fine. I got bumpers. I, uh, descended a little too fast. And I do not have much reserve thrust to not crash. Like, I am just cruising real slow. It's very, very heavy. Yeah, I know. Propeller brace stuff through fire jets out of the bottom. It's space engineers. What do you want? I would actually prefer that the atmospheric thrusters didn't have any whooshes out of them. I think they look bad. Yeah, Vice Core, I did get really, really lucky there. Oh, we're going to get lucky again, I think. Uh, oh. Good job, bumpers. Need to add a little bit more thrust on this thing. Oh, it's not the drills that are bumper. I made. I built that bumper on the bottom. That armor. Trip, and that's what's saving me every time I run to the ground. I'm also not going very fast. Yes, I mean, I'm not even full right now. But iron is quite heavy, so... Sweating. This is big heavy. No, oh, no, too much, too much. Bonk. Trunk. Iron. Plowing through the iron. Our industrial refinery is like all jammed in there, kind of weird, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Not much we can do to make that any faster. Mm -mm. The carrier does not have a industrial refinery. There just wasn't room on board for it anywhere. I could probably uh, hang it off of like the schnoz or the tail, which both look the same. I could put one off of each, but I want to finish what we have first before I start making adjustments uh, speaking of adjustments yes. so if you come back to where I am yes I'm 
This is all back here. This is a big mess. There are all sorts of different things that need to be welded up, but because there are so many blocks hiding in the way, it's really difficult to tell exactly where it needs to go first. Okay, so the best way to start it, in my opinion, is if you come under the bottom, go in, inside these armor blocks, and you can kind of see what's going on. Inside these conveyor tubes, and this is a conveyor junction that does need to be built. And then you can get all this stuff down here. And we can actually grind the light armor blocks underneath. And that should help. And you can start from underneath, and once the, those are done, it'll be easier to see what's going on. It is a mess, though. You're you're not wrong. Mm -hmm. Well, there's another one back here that needs to be welded up. Where's your cargo container? Oh, that's the refinery up there. Oh my gosh. There we go. refinery is up okay almost got the last of the stuff under here done Here's some construction components I don't like this planet. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, that doesn't work. What is this that keeps... Oh, a conveyor tube. Oh, now I'm stuck. I don't know what's happening. There we go. A lot of computers. Why are there so many computers being made? Because we need more computers. What? The uh, connection problem? I just had, yep, I just had a construction. Rush, had a connection what are you doing? <laughs> I blame you anyway, Fonsi. <laughs> Fueling of the carrier has begun. This okay. may take a while. I just figure it's something for me to do while I uh, wait for the care, wait for components to get built and or to process. This thing needs lights too.
Swimming. Not sure what. Rush is innocent. A likely story. From from conversations I have rush I've had with Rush, I know that Rush is absolutely not innocent. And she's very proud of that fact. Remember how people are like, oh yeah, D E, he's so innocent. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> Just because we keep it family friendly doesn't mean we're all innocent all up on her. Yes. Oh, but but you swear all the time during your stream or something. Oh like right, that. I forgot. Somebody said that. Or use use worse language. I don't remember. I don't remember exactly what was going on. Whatever. We use a worse language in our streams, I think is what that was. Okay, this is only filling one of the tanks, so there's something not connected somewhere between here and the rear. Let's take a look. Actually, there's a... Oh, I don't remember what it was called. Hang on. Uh, I need to go to Discord really quick. Go over here. Space engineers. So it was ready for testing. It was up here. Oh. Conveyor okay, diagram. This, this mess should be finished now. Uh, see the X ray. Stop there. Ah, because that's not done. Oh! That is done. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I go there. Or stop here. Ah. Oh! Oh. What? Inventory full. That is problem. The the aft gun is in the wrong spot. Uh not because of you, because of me. No? Hang on. I'm turning the projector off. I fall down. There we go. Yes, it is in the wrong spot. Okay. What are you? First conveyor tube. Inventory full. all this back together. I wasn't careful enough when I was building the blueprint is the problem.
90 days to recharge is reasonable. Oh, well. See this, I need to do a uh reinforced bear tube there Ninety days is completely reasonable if you're charging a super battery array or doing solar at night. <laughs> yes. Regional par reference. <laughs> See, I want to go. Another gun turret up and green. Nice. Hydrogen tanks should be uh, piped now. Checking. Okay. 
appears so. Let's test that theory. I'm gonna take like 12 trips with this thing and then I should have it full. Balls. What's the matter? I just bumped the drill rig. Filling up with fuel again. We have so much hydrogen. So are you putting the projector back on soon? Oh, I can turn on. Give me a second. I let me dock up and I'll let this tank it's unload. It's not a problem. I can get I can get other things welded up first, but So the the stuff at the rear where the rear gun turret was is going to look a little funky cuz I had to fix a few things. I still have to fix more things actually. I should the engine start. Yeah, let's see. Turn on the floor. There you go. Place all those, but I don't want to. Let's do this instead. Do you think you just plug your suit in and ta-da? What do you mean? When do you have to recharge? Uh, almost certainly. Yeah, just a, just a plug in ta-da. Plug in ta-da. Are we stuck because of silicon? What is going on? It's nickel. We're out of nickel. Okay. Why aren't you doing the iron? Wait a second. Why are you doing magnesium? Oh my gosh. You have Where's to the set iron? the iron ahead of all the magnesium in the car. No, the it already chewed through all the iron. And we're out. Yep. Uh, 
No, we're not. Got 44,000 iron left. Where? In the assemblers. Well, well, then why weren't the assemblers assembling? The, the assemblers had all sorts of things waiting to be assembled. Did you turn off the assemblers? No, they just... The iron wasn't pulling into one. Because it just stopped again. <clears throat> Empty the assemblers into the cargo containers. Empty everything out of the assemblers in the cargo containers and let it auto-pull what it wants. I mean, it's not like I put things into the assembler. We are out of nickel. It's what I. We have no. We have. We have nickel. It's just not assembling. Why okay. Is it not well, assembling? then I will pull everything out of the assembler into a different cargo container and let it pull everything it needs. I don't know how you do it so fast. I, uh, shift, click, moves a thousand things at once. So you click in one, on one side of the dual inventory screen, and then you click on the other side of the dual inventory screen, and then you shift click everything uh, that you want to move from one side to the other. Oh, Fonsi, are you? Do you want some hydrogen? See, I think this, uh, yeah, we're only at 98.6% fill with all these tanks, so not that full. Oh, no! What did you do? Oh, the power's dead. Oh, no. What do you mean the power's dead? on this poor thing. That's gone well. Build them tough though. Oh, Jesus, it's stuck in the ground. Ugh. What did I do? I didn't do anything. No, this was my fault. I forgot the batteries on the carrier on recharge. 
So it pulled all the energy out of these batteries. charge. Ugh. Okay. Well, that's gone well. But we have some fuel in the carrier, which is good. Hooray. When the sun finally comes back up, we'll have some power from solars. Yep. Sun's coming up. You can see it on the horizon there. Uh, let's see. Have you been getting the solars up top done? Yep. Oh, wow. Look at them all. That's a big chunk you got done. Impressive. Most impressive. That's because I'm just the best little helper. What was that? Why was that? That was the uh, I'm such a good wife voice. Do not want. <laughs> uh, I believe they call it uh, the Fundy baby voice. That's what they call it. Who's they? It's a it's a thing. No. It's it's that unfortunate sound made by oh jeez women who have grown up in usually like conservative church things where it's like you're you're expected to be this poised, quiet, babyish person. And that's like the ideal, and it's weird. I don't. And it affects the voice. I don't either, but I know that voice. I've heard that voice. Pow, pow, power cells. I just, I just don't understand because it makes the voice makes the woman sound powerless, and that's so unattractive. To you, yes. To anyone. <laughs> anyone with good days. Ugh. Because nobody speaks like that normally. No, they don't. No. It is not a normal voice. It is an affected voice. It sounds like anime. It that's, what, that's why it grates on me. It sounds like anime voices. Yeah. that's And that's why they sound like that. Is because there are a lot of men that prefer their women to sound babyish and quiet and whispery. I don't get it. I don't either. But I actually, so I didn't speak like that, but for a long time before college, um, you know, everybody's voice is affected somewhat by society, whether that be no use your inside voice or um, just, you know, like simple things like that. There are societal norms that uh, constrict uh, the use of our natural voices and so we change them based on what people tell us is acceptable um, and for women especially this this need to sound a certain way is to constantly real quick. sorry yep it's switching to nab cam there we go um, but yeah it's it's constantly um, you, you need to sound quieter, don't sound so authoritative, don't sound this way, just change it. And so, um, I had... But I like it when you know what you're talking about. <laughs> I, I like know. when you're an authority on something. Um, but... If you feel like you're, you're your own person instead of just some kind of ornament to hang off my arm. Oh, so like kind of what they did to Chani in the new Dune instead of, you know, making her just part of the entourage? Uh, she was kind of like that in Dune, in the books, but, I mean, the, 
The in in the original Dune novel, yes, she was like that. But in yes, uh, that's what Dune I'm talking Messiah, about. She's, she's much more of her own character. Yeah, I'm talking about in the novels the idea of her whoa. Her whoa, man. There's I I think you left your welder and everything on the I don't know, I, ground. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Anyway, I had to do a lot of work. There was a one of my theater courses um, involved uh, freeing our natural voices, and it was actually a lot of work to have to recognize how I had affected my voice because I had been told that it sounded too mannish or too low or something like that. And to that, so to I, be like, I never heard a man sound like. That. <laughs> but like to be attractive, I had to make it sound higher or um, quote unquote feminine and I'm like I, I mean I'm a woman I don't know what more feminine sounds like so but um, I had to unlearn a couple of different things but I'm just not going to make comments because you know we're going to get into that not innocent territory uh, real quick what but, about the sound of my voice <laughs> mm -hmm. but just like I just don't, I don't, this is one of those things where like, I don't understand it and my brain rejects it and I feel like it's so stupid. But if I start saying my honest opinions, people will be like, he doesn't like me. And I'm like, that's not exactly true. I might think you have weird tastes, um, but, oh, what do you mean build planners empty? Give me another one of them. Oh, got any more of them power cells? P -p -p power cells. There we go. Anyway, that was a long and involved process explaining what that I'm the best helper voice was. You're, you are the best helper. And part of the reason you're the best helper is you don't sound like that. <laughs> Capacity reach, that's silly. Your capacitor is empty. Get to work, assembler. It's like I'm making all sorts of power cells for your husband. Just calm down. Oh yeah, I'm I'm gonna be done making <laughs> making solar cells for a while here. Um, I might be able to cancel some of that hand. I, I tried to click it a couple times. I may have clicked it too many a couple times. There you go. Spice is always also. Um, Chaotic Serenity said a while ago. Um, I haven't been around in a while. What's new? Oh, I'm sorry, Chaotic Trinity. I didn't see that. It was okay. I was talking too. I saw. I saw the comment. We were talking about other things. We were talking about other things. I just switched it back. It may have gone silent briefly. Oh, uh, okay. The only reason I switched it back is because we're doing the same thing, and my computer has a higher resolution. It's not that I think I'm more important than you. It's just for viewer purposes. So understand, yeah. Okay. I guess, I guess what I want to know. So if there's anybody in the audience, don't feel too ashamed. Uh, if, if that, if you are, if you are a person who is attracted to the women's, why do you like that sound? If you like that sound. Cause I know that there are many men like you or, or people attracted to feminine people that don't like that noise. <laughs> Just, I'm just waiting for the answers. If I only knew the answer, I wouldn't be bothered. While we're you. waiting for that answer, we can answer Chaotic Serenity's question. Oh, um, what's new? Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, 
You are going to school. Yeah, I am doing that. That's the thing I'm doing. I mean, do It's an online school, yes. Uh, well, it's that. It's a big hoop to jump through in order to get. It's so stupid. Jobs. Yeah. It's so stupid because I know the jobs that that are requiring the human have a four year degree. I could learn to do your job in two weeks. But no. No, no, no. Gotta jump through the hoops. So through the hoops I jump. Yep. So that's happening. And, yep. and I've already got 74 credits because of the fast track thingy. Which is pretty sweet. Yeah. Projected graduation of a four year degree in less than two years. Because I'll be going through summers as well. Rob, exactly. Like, I just don't get it. I don't understand. I can tell you my experience just in, like, as a woman who has been told to talk like that by certain and people. Um, you know, and this would not obviously apply to everyone, uh, but in my experience, a lot of the, the men who have told me or my lady friends to affect our voices a certain way or that quiet whispery way uh, tend to be the ones who like to be in charge and like to be um, viewed as like more I don't know just they want to be in power they want to be more powerful and if you if you feel more powerful because somebody sounds softer around you or um more babyish then that's how that's how you feel more powerful around that person i don't know it's strange i don't necessarily like it but some people enjoy that Clearly, I just I just don't wear the pants. Is what's happening. <laughs> don't wear the pants in this family. Well, if you didn't like an authoritative woman, you wouldn't have married me. So, correct. Mm, girl. Man, this thing is getting pretty done. Like we've got. About half the stream left. We might, we might do this. The boys were pulling for you. Mm hmm. You know, okay, so do you, do you remember how I played Babette in uh, the stage play of the Beauty and the Beast? Uh, yes. So. I put on an affected voice, not just the French accent. Yes, yeah, you were, yeah, you were higher yeah. pitched. Yes, and there were a lot of men that really found that attractive. Mm. Which is why I put on that voice as she, like, I didn't make her sultry in a lot of the, because it was a high school production and I didn't find, I didn't find it necessary to make a high school version of her sultry. I made her cute and bubbly. And cute and bubbly automatically makes that higher pitch. And I don't know why that is. But. Ha. Huh, well, I mean. And it was a super fake French accent anyway. But, you know. Love anime, but hate the little voices. It's chaotic. I don't understand how you can separate them. <laughs> I just don't get it. It's just like... It's, I think a lot of people auditorily aren't as connected to things as you are. It's just like, make it stop. Anything. Just a sledgehammer to the speaker, please. Anything to make the... the, the <laughs> stop. Oh my gosh.
It's just, it's just, bah, nails on the chalkboard for me. And the, and the men are either, they are either like this. Oh, it's okay. There's, they're like old wise, they're douchebag or they're clueless. There's, there's, and yeah, everything's a caricature and it just, it just died. Well, but you also have to think about the Japanese language as well. If you're talking about like anime overall, yeah, they I, affect their voices, yes. but, but the Japanese language has a very different inflection type that lends itself to a different tonality. Quit your stupid jab. <laughs> I guess, I mean, that's true. I just, it's not my thing. I'm not trying to make fun of Japan here. I'm just no. I know that. Blah. Well, I'm glad that my natural voice is one that you enjoy <laughs> because mm. man, I I love not having to affect my voice. Uh, sometimes it's more natural than others. Okay, I've unmuted the microphone now that the child has left. Okay. And to remember that I'm not on push to talk anymore because Discord is. <laughs> my wife is catching but my voice sounds like old boot. So squeaky? Like. <laughs> <laughs> like, I know that's not what you mean, but, like, that's what comes to my mind when I hear old boot. I think it's mm -hmm. the uh, leathery sound that he's going for. Yeah, but leathery. I've never thought of leathery as a sound. I guess. I mean, I, um, there are leathery I mean, old I, men sound a certain way, <laughs> sure. But I, like, well, so for me, it's the it's the texture of it. There is a texture to voice, and the idea of a leathery voice. I can I can hear a leathery voice. Your voice is perfect. If you're talking to Nabarine, I agree. <laughs> Mine, I've I've actually so when I first started streaming, and I was like, oh, I hear my voice. Oh, I actually, I think I have a decent sounding voice. I think it's I think it's warm, uh, but not too intimidating. But and I I can do things with my voice, which is important to be able to do things with your voice. I can you mean like it. singing? What are you well, yeah, know? well, but like changing inflection. It's, it's a flexible voice. Because there, there are some people who are kind of like, it's more of a, you know, it's like a couple of notes and that's it. You know? You got Oh, you I got. guess that's true. Like a monotone. Oh, well, not even necessarily monotone, but just like they, their voices do like a couple different voices or a couple different tricks. And then that's, that's all she wrote. You have a tricky voice. I do have a tricky voice. I mean, so tricky that some people didn't even know that some of those voiceovers in Deadly Salvage were me. That's true. Yeah. There are a lot of characters, like minor characters that he plays because we really didn't want to have to ask somebody to say like three lines or one, you know, it was just easier to record it. There's like something that's some kind of fake future Southern accent, uh, a really bad Slavic accent. Um, but it's, but it, it, they, they were different enough to where it was fine. The docking clumps released. Yeah, docking clumps released. Well, I actually yeah. put that one through a little bit of a filter to make it higher pitched. 
because for whatever reason when I do the, the Slavic accent I have to talk like this <laughs> it's almost Czech not Slavic just Eastern European or whatever I don't know I can do the mirror, I just don't like it. I just make it again, I just make it. If you didn't hear me say it, uh, that was my impression of Merrick of Space Engineers fame. If you've ever watched him in a live stream, you know that's exactly what he sounds like. <laughs> He's just mumble, 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 and then poor Joel slash Zockley has to be like, and this is what he said. <laughs> Please talk more. Wee. I am attracted to female types, I ever mentioned it, but also am female, so uh, it's chaotic. Well, I mean, chaos is lovely. Well, that's why we said, I mean. That's why, because I wasn't going to be like, okay, men, what do you like? Right. Because I, I know that we have female viewers, and that I, and I'm sure some of the female viewers, as given by chaotic, prefer the ladies. Mm -hmm. And I don't blame them because I also prefer the ladies. <laughs> like I, I fully understand. Yeah. Like if if men weren't necessary for reproduction, I feel like we would be doomed. <laughs> they would just the men would just be like, well, I got the short end of that particular biological stick. <laughs> At least I have a biological stick. Ha. Uh -huh. Hey, I can stand when I pee. Okay. Okay, good for you. I can stand when I pee. It just gets everywhere. <laughs> Like, it's just, I gotta take the wins where I can, okay? Can I do Scottish? Ah, uh, not really. No. It's no. really bad. <laughs> oh, that was really painful. <laughs> I can do a little bit of an Irish one, but it's not very good. I don't, I don't know where it is. I have Irish in my background, but it's not very good Irish. You are rolling your R's in a weird way. Yeah, because I'm Mexican. <laughs> And I can't do like, uh, like, I can't do Hispanic very well. Like for a while I could do a, a little bit of a Ricardo Montalban style, but I can't sound like him. So it sounds weird because his voice is buttery and amazing. Um, or was, I guess, rest in peace. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just, I, I don't do it. I'm not an accent person. It's a, I have a flexible voice, but man, accents are difficult for me. Um, yeah, and a lot of people who have to do accents for, like, say, an acting job, right? They have dialect coaches, and they work yeah. really hard. We don't, you know... You go to school for that kind of thing. Yeah. It kills me, too, when people are like, Oh, can you do a British accent? I'm like, you know how many accents there are in Britain? Yeah, which one? I mean, and I would attempt to do any of them, but I have enough British viewers that would be like, All right, that's it. We're taking we're the colonies back. <laughs> and we got to burn them at the stake. Probably claim better Irish than you can, DE. Probably. You look more Irish than me, Vice Core. That's pretty uh, my, funny. <laughs> it is. He does, though. He totally does. And it's funny, and only Nab and I know why. <laughs> well, Vice Core does, too. But he de he looks more Irish than I do. Like my my last name is Scottish. I do not look Scottish. I'm also not like rabidly proud of Scotland or anything. So I'm definitely not actually Scottish. Every person who's like, oh yeah, I'm Scottish, was like, okay, and I own a kilt. So it's like, what? Okay, sure. I typically accidentally accent. Um, I've done that a couple times. So as as a performer, my background in performance, um, if I am around a certain accent long enough, I start to accidentally put it on. Um, and that has not gotten me in trouble before, but I've had to catch myself and be like, I'm so sorry, I'm not making fun of you. That's just, sorry. That's I mean, the just, thing is like, it, it's hard to do an accent when you were born without one, you know? I'm, I don't have any <laughs> accents. I, I just speak pure American English. <laughs> no accent at all. None. No accent. <laughs> Look, the movie stars talk like I do. That means I don't have an accent. You know what, though? They didn't used to. 
I know. He talked in the in the the high what was it? The no. high yeah, high American. High accent. American, which is yes. uh, transatlantic. But they call everything transatlantic. From Midwest to like uh, Upper New York, not like up upstate, not like New York. Those, you know, Hollywood only did that for a little while too. It was just the uh, that high society sound, which was only expected when they started putting sound into movies. You know, for a while, it w there was no sound, no talking pictures, and then it was like expected that it was just it was supposed to be fancy. I mean, that that's the joke, Vice Corps. No, ev everybody has an accent. But when you grow up and everybody talks like you and people in the movies talk mostly like you, you're like, I don't have an accent. There's no accent here. But if you, if I were to move to like Tennessee, they'd be like, oh, you're not from around here, are you? But you know, only in a Tennessean accent. What do you call it? Tennis? Yeah, I don't Tennessean? know. Tennessean? Tennessee? A, a <laughs> tennis? Are they tennis balls? I don't know. I don't know. Anyone from Tennessee? Enlighten me. Yeah, what do you call yourselves? <laughs> um, we call ourselves American. I was more like Texan and something yeah, else. Yeah, I'm not sure know. what that was. I don't know. I don't know either. Neither does anyone listening. Yeah, those, I mean, there are lots of different American accents as well. Whoa. It's almost like we have the third largest country, by, no, fourth largest country by land area. Because the things that make accents are people, are populations not mixing with one another. I thought Which, the U.S. was third by land. Uh, because yeah, it's, right, it it's Russia, it's Russia, yeah, and right. Canada China. than the U.S. No, I thought China had more land mass than us too. Don't think so. China, cool. A foghorn leghorn accent. I say, I say. It's fourth: Russia, Canada, China, United States. Weird. Yeah. Okay. Well, well, my. Uh, Why do you have to be so America centric, Nab? Why <laughs> no, are you so, so America first? No, I will third. But that was um, that was based on a Jumpstart game that I played when I was very young. Oh, that might have been before China made some <clears throat> territorial um, acquisitions. Yeah, that's probably <clears throat> true. <clears throat> and I just I didn't even realize that. Well, you know, it's the Aussie accent. That's just because you're from New Zealand. <laughs> it's funny. If I try to do a New, uh, an Aussie accent, I come off like a drunken New Zealander. If I try to do a New Zealand accent, I don't know what happens. Just nothing. Nothing good. I his Australian I end up in, accent is terrible. I end up in like South Africa or something. I don't know. <laughs> it's debatable, says Wikipedia. <laughs> Also, it's not include Antarctica. Oh, that's true. Antarctica, Antarctica, Antarctica isn't, a isn't a country. No flag, no country. <laughs> Those are the rules we just made up. Why is Eddie Izzard so good? He just is. He's just so good. Welcome to Church of England, Kicker Death. Mm-hmm. My brain is big. Well, you know, I mean, that might be peak China. Just saying. Yeah, they, they all have similar accents. Oh, that's no. Why it, <clears throat> that's why it sounds so messy when he tries, because it's just everywhere over there. <laughs> to be fair, I mean, each of those countries have multiple accents as yeah, well. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Like, uh, do you remember when Splitsy gave us this Queensland accent? Yeah, the accent? full Queensland. Oh my gosh! And it just sounded like he was some sort of stereotype. I, I, to me, it was like, what if someone was raised in New Jersey, but New Jersey was in Australia? That's what it sounded like to me. <laughs> Trying to affect our accent, I like it was like crazy thick. And it was like harsh too. Yeah. What it reminded me of is if you've ever heard Patrick Stewart talk in his native accent, it just kind of breaks yeah, your brain. It's just bizarre, yeah. He's speaking English words, but you wouldn't know. No. 
can't remember what part of the UK he's from originally. I can't remember, but the poem that he recites in that accent is just hilarious. Yeah. Yeah, there's some... Well, I mean, Americans miss a lot of pronunciations, too. Although in this part of the world, and I think it's because we get a... We've got a lot of miswen... Miss Western... Midwesterners. Wow. We get, uh... We get lots of wash and drowned. And drowned is like he drowned And I gotta go in and wash my hands. I don't know where that... Like, that... That that pops up a lot in Washington. Which is so weird. Like, people say Washington, and I'm like, what are... Washington? No. There's no R in there. I think what's happening is we're just picking up R's that the British leave out. <laughs> I saw everything. Well, they add that one, too. I don't know. Yeah, they, I don't know add, what that's they about. add R's, too. Whoa. Yep. I'm, I still blame... Actually, I'll blame Fonzie for that one. I'm pretty good at picking out accents. Uh, you know, doesn't doesn't mean I can speak them very well, but I can pick them out very well because of um, my work at Walt Disney World. Because we'd have people from all over the world, and so where some people are like, uh, "Where is that person from?" I don't know. And I'd be like, "Oh, that person's from Argentina. That person is from Brazil." Well, Argentina is easy to pick out because they start <laughs> speaking, and you think it's Spanish, but it's not. But it's not. It's like it's it, they slur everything together. It's I can't. It's like they heard the Portuguese from Brazil and went, "Hey, you know what? That's a good idea." Because Portuguese, no. Portuguese is messy, soft it's, too. That it, because it's like it's both French and Spanish together. And yeah, it, it's, yeah. It, it's just it's it's gone wrong is what's happened. <laughs> but um, yeah, Argentinian Spanish is very difficult for me to understand. I had. I think it's just um, Argentine. It, it's I've heard because Argentinian so was sure. from uh, Moulin Rouge, and I feel like I feel like that's well, where somebody I don't know. can tell us then. But well, it I, could be one of those things where the British say Argentine and we say Argentinian. Perhaps it's it's our version of aluminium. <laughs> I don't know. Look, I build airplanes. I can tell you, it's aluminum. The Utahns don't know how don't know how to pronounce the T. Yuan's? I've never heard anyone say Yuan. That's a new one for me. Have you heard that? You spent some time in Utah. Uh, I've never heard. I've never heard that. No. You mean Utah? Uh, but there's still a T. Oh, but we just lost you. We lost your your voice. Oh. There, um, back again. Okay. It does that sometimes for you. Well, so I've never heard them drop the T. But like there are some there are some cities that they mispronounce completely because that's how they call it, that's what they call it. So like there's a city called Hurricane, but it's Hurricane, you know. Like I don't. <laughs> anyway, so, in the American pronunciation of that word, it's Hurricane, but they say no, it's Hurricane. Which hurricane. is the which is the British uh, pronunciation of it? Yeah, I know. It's. It's interesting, because if they were talking about an actual hurricane, they'd say that. But no, the city is called Hurricane. No, I want energy. Mm. Oh, it won't let me take energy, energy. while you're plugged in. The U.S. discovered alumin aluminum, so it's actually aluminum. And actually, so it's interesting how it works i think they he called it aluminium at first and then it was like no it's aluminum because that's easier to say and it makes more sense but the the british had already latched on to aluminium and so they were like no it's aluminium and the guy's like no no no, no i changed the name and they're like well too late no we, we already say it this way it's bad oh the mountain yeah mountain oh yeah Mountain, I've heard yeah, that. Yeah, it's they swallow their teas. That's true. Mountain and yeah. I hear they microwave their tea too. <laughs> or is that just Canadians? That might just be Canadians. One one Canadian in particular.
I was working on the solar panels coming. Oh my goodness, look at you go! <laughs> Whoa! Holy moly! I told you, I'm amazing. You are amazing. You've been called a heretic by doing that? Well, that's, somebody doesn't know what the term heretic means. <laughs> it was probably somebody who likes uh, 40k because they don't know a lot of things. <laughs> that's why they think 40k is the best sci-fi ever. You're so awful. Let Look, people like things. They can like it all they want, but they can also be wrong. <laughs> all right, solar panels are done. Uh-oh. Whoa. What's going on? Is it batteries? Well, I guess not all of them. The ones in the middle no. aren't done. I didn't realize these were solar panels. But all this, the wings are done. How about that? Yay, flap flap. No, these don't want to flap flap. Don't Yay, let them flap, flap flap. This is coming together much faster than I expected it to. It's because of a nabbering. That's right. Star Trek is the best sci-fi ever. You know, when I was growing up, I agreed with you. But... You like The Expanse, don't you? I think The Expanse and Babylon 5 both are better than Star Trek in terms of science fiction stories. Uh, Star Trek is the best utopian sci-fi. Well, it was before J.J. Abrams ruined it. But that's a whole nother conversation. And then people are like, why are you gatekeeping fandom? No, 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 I'm not. People can like new Star Trek and new Star Trek is Star Trek. It's just bad it's Star a, Trek. It's a different kind of Star Trek. They're just like, it uh, has Star to Trek. be dark and uh, the Federation is uh, not actually good because uh, I hate my own country. I mean, country. if you think about it. <laughs> well, no country, no nation is perfect, but like they try. And I feel like they don't give the Federation. Yeah. The, the, the new uh, the new Trek doesn't give Federa the Federation uh credit for trying yeah the new trek is like the federation is just a like a fascism almost yeah well it's because they want they want to fight the power they want to be rebels i was so resistance. mad when that first when that discovery came out and they wanted you to root for that that lady yeah. like this is the main character and you're supposed to think she's cool no i hate her she's awful i hate everything about her yeah, because she's like, I hey, want to do what I want. I'm going to start an interstellar war. Right, and her blatant disregard for any type of authority. I, I tried to explain that to someone. They're like, you just don't like her because her name's Michael. I'm like, what? What? <laughs> no. These are my opinions and these are the reasons. It's not because, what? They ever fix a seamless plug-in for DX Expanse? So I haven't touched uh, the Draconis Expanse server since August of last year. It has been some time. Uh, I think seam seamless will still cause desyncs, but I don't know if it's like it wasn't. It was only like broken, broken for a little bit, but it has always had desync issues. Are we running low on power or something? What's going on? I don't think so. Talking about because it's not producing correctly? Yep, I'm gonna go uh, zip where it's, we're running on solar power. Looks like, let me see here. Oh look, you're all charged up, how nice. Let's fill you with gas. And we'll unlock you. Oh, I gotta move the other thing. Dang it. Hey, could you hop into the miner and moves it? Uh, sure. Make sure it has uh, stuff like its dampeners are on and its batteries aren't on recharge. Uh, where is it? Right there. Oh, this miner. <laughs> 
the on the only one we got. Okay. Uh, the hot bar should tell you. Nine things. auto. Yes. And Z I don't for dampeners. See... Look at dampeners is by your speed. Yeah, but so you want them on, yes, yes because they, they otherwise be I will otherwise, fall to yes, the ground. Correct. And then you can okay. use the un the the seven. Says, yep. Yay! Thank you. I put it on the ground, or just. Uh, you can go dock it to the uh, upper port of the drill rig thingy if you want. We. Where did where? Where did we put the drill rig? It's over here. The giant thing over there. Yeah, and I can't see it past the giant carrier. The drill arm is right in my way. Oh, right in the way. I can get, we can get in there. That's where it was docked before. Oh, it likes to go up. Yes, it has lots of lift thrust because the cuts. Because of the wonderful whiz I was? I don't know. Something like that. It is just long enough mm -hmm. to make it extremely difficult. If it fits, it chips. Well, it's it's more I'm talking about uh it's long enough just long enough for the camera to be really really difficult. Oh yeah, there's a plug-in I need I need to get you into plug-in loader and do things that way. Because it just spat all sorts of stuff out. <laughs> what did? <laughs> this is gravel. That oh, just... no, it's not just that it it's been doing that. <laughs> I don't want to eat my lunch, Mom. I didn't like it, Mom. I don't really like this. Or like the two-year-old. I want this, Mom. I don't want it anymore. I used to want it, but no longer. Yes. Oh, thank you, Mom. You gave me exactly what I wanted. Now I shall throw it away. Or mm. paint. Paint it all over everything. I will smear it all over my body. <laughs> I'm not going to either touch it or nothing. I'm just going to smear it. Up the G left the arm there is an obstacle course. Nope. What I can do is check and see how our... So I've been burning through some of the uh, hydrogen. How are we doing? The ice. So much ice. Oh, well, I guess another big thing that has happened is I won a weight loss competition, which is awesome. And now they're like interested in in hiring me to do promotional stuff. Oh, yeah. I remember that. That happened. Yeah. They're going to fly you to Vegas. Well, it's not Maybe. a done deal, but that's I the believe fly you that to is... Vegas alone. And yep. Film something. Seriously, takes pepper spray. Eat <laughs> something. I don't, okay. I don't trust them. Says the guy who's like, give the gym bros some grace. Don't give them any grace. <laughs> uh, 
But yeah, it's really weird because, you know, I've been paid to act before. I've had paid gigs and mm -hmm. paid modeling gigs. and Because you're pretty. Like... <laughs> well, that was before kiddos, but you're uh, still pretty. it's just really, really weird to be uh, potentially paid it for this. Like, I've been in productions before, but like, this is very different from what I ever dreamt <laughs> to do. We're gonna call it a documentary, but what it really is is, is uh, an advertisement. So yeah, like that's this is this is normal. This is procedural yes. for for big companies that rely on those uh, filmed promotions, which almost everything has to be now. Oh my gosh! We're out of silicon. Are we out of silicon? No, just, I'm just there's like only like three solar panels left. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, like eight, and then it's and then it's basically flight worthy i think we've got all the engines we don't have any silicon we just need is it just the gyros left it is literally just the gyros well i can't finish oh and the medical bay inside which we need i cannot for. Fish finish the the solar panels because we have no silicon So we do not. One moment. Okay. So let me see over here. I think we've got some in this. Bringing some silicon over. Anyway, Vice Corps, so that's their headquarters are located in Vegas, and so they would be flying me out to their headquarters. Uh, and we would be filming at their headquarters. And it is um, typical to have um, your talent, as they call them, right? Your actors or whatever it is. They're the talent you as a company are expected to pay for their uh, their lodging, ever, anything necessary for you to get the product that you are hiring them for. So this is, it's not weird. It's not a weird job offer. It's, it's normal for that industry, but I just... Yeah. Yeah, but like to the point where the industry is kind of like a sometimes, but to the point where Nab was like, yeah, if they'd said come to LA, I would have been like, nope. Yeah, I I would not I would not go to LA. Like your ears and la 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 la. Yeah. I think it's that's why so... they're doing it in Vegas. Well, Vegas, like I said to you, Vegas just yes, it's a different kind of scuzzy, but um, it's not as damaging to a, an actor's psyche to go to Vegas. Because, I mean, because nobody's, like, lying in Vegas. They're just like, yeah, we're all, we're sleazeballs, and we're doing sleazeball things. Right. <laughs> what we're supposed to be doing. What are you, what are you, what are you whining about? Um, so, the offer didn't come about in a weird way, either. Um, they, because I was the winner of this competition, and it's still a relatively new type of competition that they're doing, um, they are trying to promote it more because they they guarantee with that particular uh, competition, they guarantee results. And so they are pushing it hard. Um, and so they had me actually come on to a Zoom call that was put on by the CEO. Um, and he was asking me questions live as they announced their next challenge. And so after that, after I did that and people were resonating very much with it, they they reached out to me about this. They're like, you have charisma. Yeah, you have And you people had like good you. success. <laughs> also, you're smoking hot. <laughs> I don't that was not a part of it, but I don't know, you don't know. 
Jim Pro is on the I company. I do not know. You are correct. You don't know. Anyway. Best yeah, favorite animal. Have, I mean, they have a lot of successful clients, but um, I think they just knew that after I was part of that call, they're like, oh, she can make us money. <laughs> yeah. I like your moneymaker. <laughs> Which doesn't actually make money. No. Could, but doesn't. But it doesn't. And, and it never, never will. will. <laughs> All night. Oh, what is happening here? Oh my gosh. Uh oh. What? Is this doc uh, block? Is this block dancing for you down here too? Yeah, don't worry about it. Uh, okay. It's because it, I had to switch it for a different block. Because of the, the turret was mislocated down below. Okay. Uh, I can't actually, get these graded catwalks to... There we go. Don't trap yourself in there. No, I'm not welding. I'm picking up the... There we go. It's the build planner. That was exciting. Ooh. the dirt I go there you're there you're there oh you burn the ice I'm faster scary oh my goodness oh, the rest are okay okay Okey I like dokey. how it says meteor storm inbound and then just like just like with your your uh, hydrogen right fuel low oh I'm dead you know? Yeah, meteor storm meteor inbound. Storm inbound. Now. Oh, we're dead. Yeah. <laughs> we're Swung almost through the panel. size. Just kind of what I want to uh, do. Construction components and interior plates. So it's mostly the gyros left, yeah? Yeah. Well, and then some stuff in the... in the booty. Down here. But a lot of that we need silver for. 
which I'd feel better if we could just fly over and collect it. Oh, we we'll need ammunition. For We've some of the still stuff got a lot here. of magnesium. I know. Uh, production ammo. What do we got? Like auto gun cylinder. Let's just. How much is this tank? I'm going to grab you. Well, how are your batteries? Nope. We just got to leave you on there. What we're going to have to do with you is take you up over there and dock you directly. Which means we need to finish the gyros. We're getting there. Everybody bow down to BD in chat. S E Fixer Extraordinary. Oh, thank you, BD. So the way we will defend this thing is just turn one of its broadsides towards whatever's attacking us and just try to spray it out of the sky before it gets too spicy. Left to steel plates for the gyros. Fuel critical. I like it. Built like a steakhouse, handles like a bistro. <laughs> okay, well, they're functional. They're not fully. Welded, but they're all functional. Okay. Uh, 
I'll turn the uh, projector off. How did an how did an ad reset your chat settings? Mm hmm. Okay, they're fully welded now. Well, except for one, which only needs three more. Uh, everything looking good? I think everything's good. Some stuff on the bottom here. medical components because we don't have silver uh, I know where silver is my thought is the inaugural flight of this thing might be to go get silver okay just bring the miner with us well there's nowhere to dock it inside unfortunately oversight but i could easily adapt because the conveyor line goes along center line right here I easily adapt something i hate that because they all mine i hate that you have to tell it to go to all messages and top chat makes no sense like it how would it even tell what needs to be top or not it's what, what youtube wants to be top mm. there we go all the cryopods on the carrier are now functional uh that are, no that are well the, the ones sorry the ones that are fully built are now functional okay uh i need to get this reinforced t-junction made there a ladder to nowhere in here i mean there's a ladder to nowhere oh as for getting up when we're uh under when we're landed uh I'll, uh if you grab it when you're outside and then get off of it it takes you off inside oh the... got it because that's how we have to pull Hey, do you know it was ordered 10 p.m.? No. So, let me check the battery states.
And what about our tanks? Okay, I'm gonna fuel her up and then we'll take her on at least a brief flight before the stream ends. Okay. We'll get some sliver. There is a little bit over some of the explodey bits, but we can, I don't know if we'll be able to get to the silver by the end of the stream because it was a ways away. And the carrier tops out around 50 meters a second. So what we're going to do then is simply go, it's working, it's working. Uh, sure. Not Reavers Chaotic. This is just the whole point of this thing is we're supposed to find everybody and collect them. After they've after they've worked so hard on their ships that don't want they don't want to leave. Well, I mean. Basically, anyone who finds us or we find them, they get to join stream team and then we collect them. Um, that's how it works. And it's been a couple months now. <laughs> Several months. But look at this technological terror we've constructed. Okay, uh, the med room is done except for the medical components necessary. I am fueling. Was it early January this started? I can't remember. I don't know. We've missed a few too. It's hard to tell. Space engineers all blends into each other. Meteor storm inbound. Please no, please no, please no, please no, please no. Please no, please, please no. Look, it's far off to the side. We're okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, uh... Uh-oh. What? I think we just lost power on the rover. Oh, um... Turn off the assembler. Uh, it, it ran out of hydrogen. And the solar panels aren't enough. Which is not the case for this monster, by the way. I'm adding a I'm adding another light over here. So. Ah. See, I need the assembler on because I have to assemble these parts that aren't done. I'll tell you what, I will get this thing working the way I want it to.
Okay, well, I'll bring the hydrogen over, I guess. I gotta fill up one more time and I'll dock to the rover. The carrier can probably fly now. I have a fast way to fuel her. This was just to get enough to make sure I could do all the adjustments I needed. Filling this tank again, I will come over and dock it to the rover. And it'll chew through this and recharge the batteries a bit. Uh, kinda, Serenity. Okay. Uh, hydrogen delivery, shortly. I like how, like, one of the most useful vehicles that I have is this little hydrogen ship. Mm -hmm. There's something kind of fun about just running a little fueler around. Rover's running on the hydrogen tanks in the back. Okay, let's make sure that these thrusters are all on. Okay. Do I need to make, like, a couch down there? Oh, this ladder shaft wasn't built all the way. Oh, whoops. Oh, whoops, whoopsie. this to fly we might want to cannibalize the silver in the met in the cryopods for the medical room yeah i thought that too anyway what's the station Please stop changing the grid. Oh, okay. Okay, good. Okay, so... I am in control. What I want you to do is I want you to break uh, the supports when I tell you. Uh, okay, give me a second. I'm... This is still not enough to make the med station, but... Let me know when you're ready. Alright. Ready. Okay, go ahead. Break it. Mm. 
supports should be broken. She flies! Oh, look at that. Oh, it's glorious. She's not very fast, but that's fine. Now I can raise the gear. Look at that. Does that not look the part? Oh, it looks so good. I'm gonna set her down. I was just about to do that, but that's fine. Well, we just need a catwalk there, and then we're good. Yeah. What's left on the medical room? Just <sighs> a couple more. Just need... Mm. Or what we can do, I have an idea. Since we're leaving the rover here. Just until you get it. You're gonna cannibalize the one on the rover? No, 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 no. The rover, the rover one needs it. Yeah. But I'm putting just a survival kit on this one. Oh, I got pulled it. it off of the other, uh, the other thing. Okay, and then yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. Now let's get my master Do we want to take done. this projector off? Uh, we can, yeah. Knock okay. it off. Might be useful later for repairs. Well, it's we kind want... of in the middle of everything. Yeah, but... we can, we can, we kind of, we can slap it on somewhere else later. Uh. We do need lights on the outside. Yes, we do. I just because our daytimes time. are nothing. Must be winter on this planet. <laughs> Everywhere. glad we could help you with that um you are welcome to play with us if you are part of the discord and you want to be part of this in particular you are welcome to do that oh 
Oh gosh, I'm almost there for the refuel. Well, that's what I was going to do. I was going to hop around to some of these uh, strikes and see if they left any goodies. Silver's what we want. Yep, I know. Oh, that looks promising. What are you? Platinum. Nice. Grab it. I named the ship Investigator, by the way. Okay. Because that's what we're doing. Investigating. It reaches out, it reaches out, it reaches out. Repeat the word, repeat the word. There's so many holes. It's ridiculous. Ugh, the lighting makes it very difficult to see what's in here. What the? There are parts of a ship in here. Is it one of the drones we shut down? I don't know. Maybe? Or is it one of the things that we got wrecked? One of our things that got blown up? No, it's a, it's got like the LED lighting armor. Like the Tron stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Carrier is fueling. Carriers fully fueled. Wow. All right. Oh, I am not. I, my fuel is quite low. Would you like to come with me on a on a Where? trip of pure imagination? Or I guess we need <laughs> lights first, don't we? Yes. I'm just very excited. This thing's been in the making for so long. Like, what, four streams now? Uh, I think so. It's looking pretty cool. That platinum is being chewed up. There was actually quite a bit of it. Silicon. So many shiny silver metallic ores. I can't tell which way the searchlight points. That way, okay. Speaking about craving about going back to SE, so our eldest loves this game too, yep. and he recently asked if he could go onto the mod shop, and oh man, is he playing modded. <laughs> like father like son. Ooh, uranium. I got a couple searchlights on. 
That should do the trick. Plugging off, I think. Whoa. Your health is critical. I just missed the carrier, apparently. Alright, should we go? And then end the stream as we go? Uh, sure. Uh, actually, we need the miner, is what we'll need. Because we want silver. Yes. Uh, I don't need to get the docking stuff shenanigans yet. I just need to grab it and plug it in. Let's see. Not on recharge there. There's nowhere to really dock it. Oh, the mag. Bonk. Let's go. Ready? Yeah, where am I gonna sit? <laughs> you shouldn't need to. This ladder is wrong. You built the ladders incorrectly. Upside down. One of them is, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, where is it? I want silver. Or something. Like, it's really weird. I get onto one, and then it's like, it won't let me actually get off of the ladder. It's really weird. We Be careful. I'm careful. See. Reminder, there is no more there are no more cryopods on here, so I can't cryopod. So you wanna grab the there. cryopods from the grid from the rev two real quick? Yeah, I'll go do that. I'll come back down. Oh wow, we're you've went up really high already. Yeah, it's got lots of uh lifting thrust. I'll just grab this. Uh, re <sighs> Whoa. <laughs> Gosh. Okay. I can do this. I can get in. Okay, I'm on. Okay, you got enough for two cryopods? I got the one. Uh, because it's med components. So, I will ground, grind down. Oh, awesome. some of the, uh, uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay, we should be fine. <laughs> Away we go. Yay. Spinny, 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 go. Here's my landing gear. How exciting. Hmm? Just this moving. Isn't it neat?
I'll just fly right into a chasky. No. We are uh, all ahead flank. We get the silver, come back, get everything built. And then this is also- We're not, we're not finished yet, guys. <laughs> no, this, the carrier is not finished. And we still need to give her some uh, vehicles inside some proper airplanes, I think, would be appropriate. Yeah, we're just looking for the silver. Do you know where to go? Because I don't have silver. I've got a silver like... GPS. We're going towards it. It's 50 kilometers away, so we're not going to make it there today. No. But I just wanted to get her moving. Look at this. Look at us go. Behold the technological terror we've constructed. I didn't arm the the medium cannons, but the point defense, the whole defense guns and the the smaller turrets are all armed. Not with tons of ammo, but enough to at least pew pew a little bit. All right, well, it is that time as we majestically sail through the air. So it looks like we're going really slow, but watch as we get closer to the ground here, just how fast we're zipping along. Oh yeah, along. we're going really fast. Um, should I go and check what that ore is right there? Uh, I should have put an ore detector on this. Uh, yeah, you probably it. should have. Uh, none of the ores nearby were silver, because I flew. D I flew across all these. Okay. Look at us go! Just booking it so much faster than the the rover. Even if we weren't moving at 50 meters a second, it would still be faster because we can go as the crow flies. Mm-hmm. I still need to fix her paint, pull off the uh, wind turbine on top. Uh, it's a beautiful hat. Yeah. Are you enjoying walking around up there? I'm just kind of standing right now, but yeah, it's yeah. pretty exciting. I would not advise jumping. No. I've already gotten five kilometers closer. Look at us go. Yeah. Look at us go! It's so cool. We should end the stream now. We should end the stream now. Uh, all right. I'm gonna avoid this research base real quick and then say thanks for watching, everybody. There's this something on the thing. ground. What? I don't know. There's something on the ground. Just where? To the south east. Uh, it's in a certain research research base. Is it? Okay. Yeah, that's why I'm turning away from it. You don't see the Oh, it antenna? is. No, now, no, I turned on the... It's so much more fun when you don't know what it is. <laughs> I guess. Until it shoots you. Less yeah. fun then. Anyway, sorry, bye! Yeah, goodbye, everybody! Thanks for watching! <laughs>